All right, yep, just doing a video. Trying to um, remember I've got to go to sleep and do other things like that. But I'll be honest with you, it, it's starting to clue in. I just, uh, well, crystallize or whatever you want to call it. You may see my bald head or whatever the hell you want to call it head. I wish you could see this. I'll try to put it up a bit closer because I'm not really looking, obviously. I don't even, okay, this so the camera would be pointed that way. So this is a, a miniature I just found uh, early this afternoon. Didn't even know I had kind of like a modern figure. I don't even, like I said, I don't know what you guys can see. Um, and when I saw it after, I was like, okay, maybe I'll pretend that's gonna be the ambassador to go uh, talk to Charles in Italy and, and um, try to convince uh, uh, them to join the Central Powers. <clears throat> But I know that it, that's not going to happen. And um, I don't, sorry, Richard, I don't know your full uh, avatar name, thingamajig or whatever. I don't even know if you're going to watch this video. And I don't even know if I'm, yeah, what am I saying? I don't even know if I'm going to post it. I post most, not all, actually. There's some I'm just like, good God, Chris, stop. Um, where am I going with this? Probably all over the place. I was going to try to do a video. Hold on. <coughs> it's one thing I've got to learn, man. As I just take a sip. I don't know what the hell my problem is. I swear to God I'm going to drown. That way is um, one of those idiots that uh, seems to not understand the concept of allowing the liquid to pour into my mouth. I don't need to suck it in kind of thing with a... Anyways, it's, I often... Um, and then it's just like liquid and... Liquid in the, or close to the lungs, not good. That's what I'm trying to say. So what I've been doing up here, and I'll talk about this other bits. Um, well, I'll, I'll try to, hopefully it'll frame stuff. One of my favorite times in my life, and probably it's going to be forever, is um, was my time in the university. Absolutely loved it. Um, I can't even, um, I was, it was just so immersive to me and I just did not, um, it, it was everything. Um, I didn't, and this is what's happened all over again in a weird way. Um, uh, now that I'm, uh, comparing them, um, <clears throat> cause, oh my gosh, you have no idea how many times I've reminisced, uh, I was just there. I was, I woke up, university, my courses, off I went. And I was in Wonderland. It was just such a beautiful time. Uh, I just couldn't believe they allowed me to take courses that, you know, I was just like, what? I, I just knocked my socks off. Um, I, I, I was fantasy role playing in real life you know you know what i mean i was playing scientist it was like ah i just just it was amazing um and here i am doing whatever's and what i'm trying to say is back in the time when i was in university land um i didn't think about current events i didn't even know what the hell was going on in the world it was just that it was amazing. And here I am now. I swear to God, I'm not kidding. I'm not joking around. Um, I'm shocked when people say stuff because I'm not in that world anymore. I don't get up in the morning. I don't watch my Al Jazeera. I don't go off to BBC World News. I don't do any of that stuff. I don't read any. I don't go there anymore. And I hope to God I never go there again. And I'm not judging. It's just not for me is what I'm trying to say. I can't deal with that stuff. I don't want to listen to uh, Chicken Little anymore. I just uh, uh, can't go in that world. Um, I'm not kidding you. Uh, the last major current event that I remember uh, hearing about that there was an earthquake in Turkey. I'm not, I'm not trying to be, you know, whatever. That's the last biggie that I I know there's still a war going on uh, with Russia and Ukraine, I think. Otherwise, there would be like people going berserk. Um, <clears throat> That's it. Uh, I'm sorry. I, I'm okay with it because I remember now what it was like to be in the university. And I daydream about that. I'm like, Chris, this is where you are. You're here. 
just in a different way. You found a different groove. And I oh, suck that son of a bee like you wouldn't believe. And I want to keep on trucking with this. Um, anyways, let's go to here and I'll tell you what. You know, I'll go on to some other stuff. Um, yep. Uh, I did it before and after, but it's a really bad before and after because the resolution for this is when I, you know, I bump it up with iFan view and whatnot. Um, so the Fourth Army has uh, withdrawn from um, along here from the Nida. Um, we blinked, or the Russian Fourth Army is realizing, you know what? Um, like I've said, or the whole army, the whole area here, um, uh, Danilov there. Darn it, I can't remember his first name. Yuri. Uh, um, Yuri Danilov. Uh, the Black Danilov for some reason. i got to figure that out still. Um yeah, so we gone back here, but we've concentrated a massive amount of strength points. There's seven here, four here. I know that's where the headquarters are, but they're in Kielce. That should help uh, with the retreat thing. Remember, they've got to hit four hits to force a retreat. There's five here. Four. Look, I'm doing the best I can, man. Um, two, but like I said, you got to get there first. And then four here, So and seven there. And I left the poor 10th core HQ there. I mean, what the hell do you want me to do, man? Um, <clears throat> that's it. Um, now I'm off to the second army. And this is the thing. Oh, God. Too bad, eh? We, we lost Fluke. Uh, or I think that's his name. Um, the 10th army. The Russian 10th army. Damn! Because I just need something there. Wait until you... Uh, well, I'm trying to do... And there's the other... Oh, here. That's what I wanted to talk about. When it, which is what I'm thinking about. Another uh, frame bit here. Hold on, I gotta grab some more water or something. Jesus H. Christ. <clears throat> okay. Hold on here. Swish a bit, maybe? All right, and the other frame uh, bit is I'm starting to clue in when I think uh, perhaps uh, a lot more so now, uh, not, maybe not originally, but maybe it was part, partia, partially um, some of the reasoning for doing the live streams is the live stream now is becoming a bridge for me between uh, gaming and World War One, And what I mean by that is part of my week is not, has nothing to do with gaming just World War One. I'm, I'm uh, communicating with human beings that um, have nothing to do with gaming and don't want, uh, I'm not saying don't want to, but uh, that's not their primary interest or focus or that's not what we communicate about. We're only communicating about World War One stuff. And then, uh, you know, obviously I'm doing gaming stuff and then it's like, I want to talk with you guys with this, you know, whatever. And it's like, holy cow, here's the bridge. Um, is the Saturday live stream. So there we go. Um, so now, uh, like I said, with this missing bit of the, uh, it's just, it's, it's too big. So now I've got the second army here with, um, Nikolai Protopopov. Sorry, if, uh, it's not, I'm trying to be whatever. I just need to remember there's a lot of freaking, and I don't have a, like, I'm not trying to be false modesty or any of that F and stuff. Um, I'm not that smart, uh, and uh, I can only retain so much information, unfortunately. So I have to keep remembering, uh, reminding, like repeating names and so on and so forth. That's what I'm trying to say. <clears throat> so here, what I'm also trying to say is this map, and I think I've mentioned it before, is I need, it's my come home place because there's so much going on. And like I said, it's not trying to be whatever. I'm so much going on for me. Um, oh, the F. I, I, well, I have to do a separate thing. I can't move the camera that way uh, for the uh, Western Front. I can talk about it a little bit. Um, it's, I'm doing, remember, uh, uh, what I want to do things is not just, uh, yet again, Richard, uh, this is our, also partially, trust me, man, your comments, uh, this is the stuff that, uh, you know, I, I love bit. There's the other bridge of, you know, doing these videos, I guess. Um, to help me and trust me some of your comments or many of your comments are um, my first reaction was a uh, ah, and I was like excellent that means he's hitting home Chris 
he's he's got stuff that uh, you need to think about. And I was like, yeah. Like, that's, you know what I mean? I, I like being put in my place because it makes me think. Uh, I love that stuff. Um, hmm. Here we go. There's a lot. Um, so, yes, Richard, and yes, everyone else like Charles and uh, saying, you know, hold on here. You know, so on and so forth. Think about things. How far do you want to astray historically and, you know, that stuff. Yep, yep, yep. But I'm going to say this. Um, I am taking my time. This is why I always come back home. Um, is I am going to explain, hopefully, my plausibility. But remember, I'm doing my things. In the long run, I'm sharing. But, you know... Uh, tough bananas that's what i'm saying i'm going with what i want to do uh and if it makes sense it makes sense all i've said before is if you see daleks appear ever on one of my things um that's it, it uh, to me it would be like uh the fawns showing up that uh, jump over the shark thing uh thing somebody at work mentioned that to me that was like um some kind of metaphor for that's when a tv show goes to hell so I always thought that was kind of interesting. And I was always thinking, you know, uh, on it's because Daleks, I never saw the episode, but uh, uh, the new version of Doctor Who, I guess they used Dalek. I got a t-shirt for it. Um, um, Daleks, I guess the British government used them in World War II or something. To, anyways, um, yeah, wait till I go to Western European, uh, the Western Europe conflict zone. Oh, oh there's like... I think I mentioned the uh, there's the Mets offensive the French want to do, but then they want to obviously they need to move some troops away, and they're like, okay, northern northern France, Belgium, we'll get the French to uh, uh, the British to extend their thing maybe towards Albert, and they're like, no, not going to happen. Uh, that's doubling, but uh, like I said, I'll do a side thing. So the uh, the Brits are going to say, okay, we'll go to Arras. Well, that's only one more hex. We'll extend it that. However. For us to say that, here's the caveat, our, our counter proposal is we want access to like proper control to two single rail uh, line. Oh, God, I'm sorry. That's where I want to go. Uh, I am just ugh, in flipping heaven when I start talking about proposal, counter proposal and all these little uh, narrative crap of uh, dealing with like three. Oh, yeah, we have to worry about this. It's not the whatever map but you get the idea of like um little uh single track going this way and it's like no the brits want that control even though it's french rail and uh the brits don't have a flipping clue how to use french rail yet um properly um oh jesus h christ i love this world um i'm just so flipping privileged aren't i and there's other people got to worry about so many other things and it just wants sometimes there's the other flip side i have to stay away from that type of a balance of um collapsing of um uh, just getting too uh wound up and knowing that there's so much suffering going on oh jesus h sucks doesn't it all right let's not think about that because uh, i'll go crazy yep all right yeah um that's it, I guess, because like I said, I'll go crazy. <laughs> yep. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, I've got to remember, this is, um, I want to stay away from, go away from here. Go away from wherever. I'll try to be nice to people. And uh, you know what? Uh, I'm sorry if you want to, uh, whatever. It's been helping me a ton. And it's not because I'm some kind of crazy Buddhist, whatever. <clears throat> But um, it's been helping me a ton is I constantly remind myself as I wander around going to the shops and stuff. I'm staring at, the, at me. I'm staring at other manifestations of myself. Um, and uh, why would I want to piss myself off? Um, it doesn't make any sense. Um, uh, and it really is. Uh, I mean, oh, you know, I don't want to get into the cosmic consciousness and all that crazy nonsense as if any human being could even comprehend that give me a break um oh it's intriguing isn't it anyways that's it uh, let's go back to this um
Yep, yep, yep. University, World War I University, there we go. And I hope uh, I never graduate, I guess. <laughs> Just keep on going as long as I can keep paying the tuition. All right, hope you're having a fantastic time. And I don't, yeah, see you later.